Oh, cute, cute. All right, there's nobody here yet. That, that's fine. Is it, is it working? Why isn't it showing up? Here we go. Hello. Hello. Oh, hello. Oh, people are here. Oh, I'm sorry. I was messing with my computer. I did not see you guys. Hello, Jasmine. Hello, Elle. Hello, Jess. Hello, Little City Zoo. Hello, Davis. Hello, Wild Boy. How you guys feel? Welcome to the stream. I'm just getting things settled for a second. There are eight people here. Wow, way more than I thought would show up. Hello, Ebony Rabbit. Hello. Hello? Oh, I'm getting hot in this already. Where? Okay. Okay, give me one. Oh, I already got one like. Oh, thank you. Hello, Langan and Animals. Hello. All right, give me one. I need some daily Winslow attitude. I might grab Winslow um, once I figure this out real quick. He's guarding the window right now. He's a, a very good little guard dragon. I'm a big fan of your unglamorous side of Petu. Thank you. It's not exactly the most glamorous thing, in my opinion. Here we go. Oh, I look. So beautiful. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, I just had to. Okay. But oh, there's ten people. Hello, all ten people. Thank you for coming. Um, I'm trying to figure out some technical stuff, so I apologize if I don't see your messages right now. Aha! aha figured it out. Okay. Okay. Oh, cute. I, oh, here we go. Here we go. I got a baby leopard gecko the other day, and her name is Momo. Oh, cute. The itty bitty channel, and I'll make sure to film all the gross stuff. Oh, we can talk about my bug bite. That's really gross. Jess, hello from the UK. Hello, Jess. Hello from across the pond. Oh, there we go. This is freaky because I have my burner account up here. Hello, Amelia on my laptop right here. So, you know, I know at least one person. Oh, hello. Hello, Olivia. I'm loving your outfit. You are stopping the game. <laughs> Thank you, wild boy. Thank you. I went for like, like a Gwen Stefani look. Cause I, I was, I'm going to take this off for a second. I was watching the voice last night and she just looks so beautiful. Um, but yeah, your whole aesthetic reminds me of Fran Fine. Derek. Thank you. That's the greatest compliment I've ever gotten in my life. Thank you. <laughs> so yeah, this is my first ever live stream. So thank you so much to the 17 people who have showed up. I love you. Um, you are serving looks. Thank you, Amelia. Mwah. Um, I'm prepared though. I have snacks. I have caffeine, goldfish, a 10 foot long. Oh, hi, Jim. I had a feeling. Uh, okay. I did not think anyone was going to show up. I really just thought it was going to be like me and Jim. <laughs> right now she hides when I move. But do you have any tips for taming? Taming takes a very long time with leopard geckos. I would even venture as far as saying that even like Bean sometimes kind of struggles with it. Because it kind of depends on a personality. <laughs> Sorry, that was my, my mirror. Um, but just time and doing it consistently is really going to help you and also like maybe start with like five minutes and then slowly um what's it called this is why i don't live stream <laughs> you guys are gonna see oh hello greg thank you for making it you guys are gonna see how much editing i do <laughs> but oh yeah i thought it was just gonna be like me and jim because i did a live stream once on my instagram it was just me <laughs> so i was fully prepared for that but um yeah, thank you for coming to my first live stream, of course. Um, I actually have always wanted to live stream. I just, I've always been very nervous about it because I do actually have a slight stutter. 
I just got done watching RuPaul's Drag Race on Tug Season 7 on YouTube. That sounds like a fun afternoon, Wild Boy. That sounds like a fun afternoon. Um, I have like a little bit of a stutter. I say like and uh a lot. And also I just never realized I could just live stream on my phone. I thought I had to have like a Twitch setup, you know? So this is just my ring light and a mobile phone. Um, what's it called? Mount? There we go. There we go. I'm sitting at work. You know, I wasn't gonna miss this. Thank you, Jim. My big, one of my biggest stands. So did you know the time zones are a thing? Because I saw that you were gonna go live at 4 p.m. Left early and went home and realized it was two hours ahead of you and left. Oh, well, I, you, listen, I did actually put PST, which is Pacific Standard Time most places but at least you got a nap in it i live for the drama and pearl is fine as hell let's see amelia we all say like and i'm too much don't even worry let's see it's it's oh my god it's 12 a.m wait is that I, w I went to public school is that midnight or noon but one of my rats is still loving free roaming destroying everything in my bedroom i feel that so i will stay watching okay Oh, 12 a.m. It's midnight. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, chat. Thank you. Um, here. Actually, let me go get our Lord and Savior. I was homeschooled. Pacific Standard Time and CST mean nothing to me, even though I'm supposed to be an adult. It's fine. I, I, I didn't know what 12 a.m. was. Trust me. It's fine. I'm going to go get our Lord and Savior real quick, Winslow. So enjoy looking at how messy... My bathroom truly is, and also I'm gonna move this so like if you get seasick or something like that, I apologize. At least you guys get to look at Britney for a hot minute. Cute. Winslow. There you are. Oh my god, the chat's going in crazy. Okay, okay. <laughs> here he is. Everybody rejoice. Your savior is here. Oh, hi, Anna. People want you to bless them, Winslow. What? <laughs> I don't even know. Uh, I was like, oh, jokes with you. I, like, um, don't want to be taken seriously. I mean, yeah, that's me. Um... Winslow, where should you go? I gotta eat out of here real fast. Well, thank you for stopping by, Anna. Thank you. I appreciate it. Cute. Okay. Um. Handsome boy. All praise. Blessed be, friend. Blessed be, fam. Oh, Winslow has appeared. I'm gonna put him right here. Then you guys can, like, look at his both, but I can still look at the chat and not have to only do... I apologize if I missed a lot of chat while I was doing that. It just went crazy like the second I moved. All right, we all been blessed by our savior. Yes, here he is looking, I feel like a better person in his presence. Hello, Rat Tails, thank you for coming. Oh, I know. Now you guys can really experience what I go through on a daily basis from just the unbridled sass. Um, yeah, so. I'm gonna crack open a Coca-Cola and, you know, I, I don't know what this live stream is gonna be. Like, I'm not gonna talk about a topic because, um, that's boring. But if you guys wanna, like, ask me stuff, that's cool. He looks so damn small. Well, it's because he's far away. <laughs> no, I, he's not the biggest bearded dragon, but he's from a pet store, so I still love him. Oh, boy. I've been born again due <laughs> to King Winslow Lovely. Long may he reign. Did you see Katya on her tour? No, I wanted to, but I had to work. Queen of Hoops. Oh, thank you. Hey, I actually caught the live. Oh, thank you, Brittany. Thank you for coming by. Thank you for acknowledging the hoops. Have you ever had rats or considered rats? The pettiness on the screen is real. <laughs> what I'm looking for. Thank you, Adrian. Some of the beardy is sorry. He's not watching. He's sleeping. That's fine. Um. I love rats. It's just, I don't have room for rats because, like, you need multiple rats. I don't have room for, like, a big, 
enrichment filled cage right now in my life and also like they're very social and this thing takes up 90% of my time so I like rats maybe one day just not right now you oh. rat tails you have 10 rats Ooh, sis also by the way please let me know if I'm I understand. Girl, I'm sure you know exactly what I mean when I say... I mean, I guess Jasmine wants to live that life too. Has the look of hunger. I mean, maybe just like hunger for your soul. Your lipstick is popping and what's that sassy look? What doesn't he look sassy? I feel like Winslow knows I'm wearing dirty pajamas. <laughs> he knows everything. He's very smart, very judgmental. But, um, you know, very good boy. He's very good, right? He's being very good. He hasn't started, like, running around. It's because he was in the window all day. I want a rat one day. I've had pet mice, but no rats. I'm gonna stick for my bunny now. Well, bunnies do need a lot. They need a lot. Like, that's, that's a lot. I mean, look at his, I know, I know. Look at his face. To be fair, you take up 90% of my time with your videos. Oh, thank you! Queen! I have stands now. I love it. Hello to the 25 people that are now here. I also have no idea how long this is gonna be. Dated a rats. Dated a rat once. Well, wait, that's not a rat. Jim. He is perfect. He is. I can understand the socialization, hence why I'm up at 12 up until midnight. BRB lights out for my reptiles. Okay, have fun, wild boy. <laughs> my god. Jim roasting everybody. I mean, that's just his daily life. But yeah. So I'm a little late. Just got home. That's fine. I've only been doing this for like 12 minutes. You're fine, Alexa. I went to HHM the other day and my mom went to buy a hoodie and it was more than we expected. So we... Oh, whoops, 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 whoops. Here we go. So we didn't get it. The girl working that cashier thanked us for not looking out at her. Oh, just thank you. Made me think of you. That's what I'm here. I'm here to share the sassiness of my lizard and for to advocate for retail workers' rights. You know what I mean? Oh, look cute. I tried to do something cute with my hair today. It was it's a special occasion, you know what I mean? But ooh. You guys should see the look that I'm turning tomorrow. Ooh. It's like like Aunt Zelda realness. Like wearing all black look like I'm about to what's your name Megan that's what <laughs> I've had and, and don't feel bad if no one knows my name this is Winslow our king lord and savior long may he reign I'm Megan I'm a woman who gets to take care of this scaly potato good boy though you good boy so yeah and we are currently in my bathroom Dolly Parton is here as well. I'm gonna do a famous drag queen look for Halloween. Oh, I love that. I wanted to be, and as Cody said, I am a woman. <laughs> that's a pretty name, my name is Tara. Oh, that's cute. How old is Winslow? Winslow is about two and a half years old now. He's almost three. I have a fiber on my lip. I consider it a beardy, but too much work. I get it. <laughs> I get it like like this morning like Winslow pooped on my floor and I had to open my window and all my neighbors heard me editing my video <laughs> I was like you're welcome sure you explained this before but why did you choose to get a bearded dragon well I really always wanted a lizard and I was finally in a position where I could support one I have a job and stuff like that and I was reading up about them and I was just, I really like their look too. Like they look so spiky and I don't know. I, I wanted a lizard and I really liked the look of the bearded dragon. I, like for a while there, I didn't really like the look of leopard geckos, but I've since come around obviously because now we have the queen bean and Mr. Peanut Butter. All right, I missed a little bit of chat. I'm having trouble deciding on what drag look to do. Hmm. 
yeah i don't know i would say trixie but that was very advanced like i don't even know if i could do that i'm sitting here in lashes and liner so maybe the like good beginner one might be katya <laughs> red lip and a nice big liner might be able to get with you um here we go oh oh oh! your sister had eight bearded dragons oh i could not handle that i get enough attitude from one imagine can you imagine eight winslows like oh I don't even know if I'd be alive. Why do I have to do all the talking in our group speeches if you're clearly cap capable of handling yourself? That was like four years ago, Jim. Okay, hello. And I was a freshman. I was very nervous. Also, like you act like I gave a speech before this. <laughs> all right. Oh, good God, eight. Always wanted a beardy or Euromastix, but I have like eight fish tanks. Is that Tegu's? but just spelt wrong, or doggos. A box turtle, five hermit crabs, three dogs, and a cat. Yeah, girl, you good. Yeah, I have birds in there enough. I don't need a beardy too. I'll just stick to snakes and some other lizards too. Eventually I want a beard dragon. They're really good, good pets, like I'm not gonna lie. I mean, the attitude I get 90% of the time, but I think it's just Winslow. Like everyone else on Instagram is like, oh my God, guys, me and my beard dragon. We're like best friends and me and Winslow are like, Winslow like wants to fight me 24-7. Degus are related to chinchillas. Oh, the rodents. Okay. Public school. What can I tell you? Um, cute though. I love rodents. What lashes do you use? Um, these are, ugh. let me get the box out. Cause I, I feel like there's something by like devilish or something or delicious lashes. I don't know. There's like, oh my God, when you glow. Welcome to owning a bearded dragon. They're in like a style called like Emilio or something like that. So, okay, let me grab the lash box real quick. One's those fine, by the way. Here we go. These are devious lashes in the style Emilio. Um, okay, okay, I missed a little bit of chat. Degu's, let's see. Arika, Hero, Trixie, Pearl, Violet, Kennedy Davenport, or Katya. Violet would be good if, if you have like a very small face and very like fine features. She might be a good option, especially because you can kind of borrow from more like vintage looks. Um, Kennedy might be kind of hard because she really goes for like glam, glam, glam. So does Eureka. And Trixie, I mean, she's got like eyebrows on her forehead. Okay. I have two axolotls. Aquariums are, Aquariums are very difficult. That's why I don't have one. <laughs> are you going to do a Halloween special on your channel? I have something very special planned for the whole month of October. So stay tuned. It's gonna be it's gonna be cute. I love Daegu's, just found out they're legal in my states. Okay. Axolotls are illegal in California. I did not know that until very recently. Pearl is a good one, super style. Violet is a super Violet is a good one. Super stylish. Of course. Super stylish. Dude, I'm just out here buying dollar store lashes. It's hard out here. Girl. I understand. The only reason I have like nice lashes these days is because we have a store now in the mall that specifically sells like lashes, like for like forever. I've been using like like stuff from like Ulta and stuff like that. Hollow, <laughs> Hollow Winslow is gonna be lit. Yes, it is, Jim. Yes, it is. What's your favorite holiday? Halloween and Halloween only. What camera do you use for filming? I use a Canon. T5 Rebel. It's kind of an older model, but it still works. Oh, okay. There we go. Okay, so I'm all caught up. Yes. Halloween is going to be great. Um, I have a lot. I have some big plans for Halloween. Hopefully I can execute them all because it might be a little expensive, but I love Halloween. I've always loved Halloween. Shangela. Who doesn't love Shangela, though? I love it. I love that the chat's just Halloween at Drag Race. It's really my essence. Spooky season is where it's at. Yes, nerdy girl. Yes. 100% love spooky. Spooky season, sorry. Halloween is so rubbish in the UK. I'm here for Halloween's love. Winslow's probably going to have a Halloween costume too. I just don't know what he is going to be. I think last year he was Daenerys Targaryen. No. Was he Elfo? I actually did like a Halloween special either last year or the year before on my Instagram. And I was Lucy from Disenchantment, which not gonna lie, might make a reappearance. 
and Winslow was Elfo. And I, I tried to get Bean dressed up like Princess Bean. I'm here for the drug bag cameo. I'm gonna find a way to get Drunk Megan back. She's fun. Um, but I was trying to get Bean to be Princess Bean, but she was like not having it, so it's fine. But Winslow was a very cute elfo. I might post it as like a throwback or something like that. Winslow, come here. Let the people see you. Now that I'm 18, I don't know what to do for Halloween. I guess just rewatch. Just like enjoy. There's like an ambiance with Halloween. You know, like you can watch the movies like Beetlejuice. I love um, Hocus Pocus, Halloween Town. I'm fully 22 and I, all I want to do is sit around and watch Halloween Town. <laughs> How are the Minecraft pets? Fantastic. Um, my only problem is trying to make sure I get no more than five Minecraft dogs. So, I hope you do some, oh my god, the Hex Girls were just iconic. The most iconic Scooby-Doo side characters of all time. At me. Oh, a potato. I have a desk decoration contest at work. I'm stressed, but also must win or I only child fit over that place. Wait, what? Or I will only child fit all over. The oh, only child fit. I get you. I'm almost 31 and all I want to do is sit around and watch Halloween movies too. Yeah, it's a mood. Do you ever like, do you ever do like a group costume with you and your pets? I just, I... I, I actually had a really great idea. Um, I was gonna like make a Drogon costume because I was also gonna make Winslow a Khaleesi costume and then Winslow was gonna be Khaleesi and I was gonna be Drogon. Um, however, I did not make the costume, but Winslow was still Khaleesi. He was a beautiful Daenerys Targaryen, by the way, guys. I don't think you understand how just absolutely gorgeous he looked. He had a wig and everything. Um, the Hex Girls are <laughs> where my days and girlfriends came from, LOL, love it. Perks of living in Orlando is having all the parks, Halloween events, no problem for 23. 23-year-old lady! I feel that, Amelia. I feel that. I want to date the Heads girls. I don't blame you, Brittany. I don't blame you. I only started celebrating Halloween about two years ago, so I've always been a Christmas freak. I don't mind Christmas. Hello, Madison. Hello. Um, I don't know. Like, 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 girls are sexual. <laughs> yeah, there we go. I just like Christmas music. Christmas is, I mean, it's, it's fun. You know, Mariah Carey's All I Want for Christmas is You. Bop. Thanksgiving is my holiday due to the food. I mean, facts are facts, America. Facts are facts. Um, I mean, Christmas is okay. I don't know. Any, any, any holiday I have to go see my relatives, I'm just like, ugh. Uh, what's new? I'm just sitting here. Every Spirit Halloween opened in August near me. Same opened? So I used to work in this store in the mall that closed like last year. They opened the Spirit Halloween in that storefront and me and my friend went in there because we both used to work there and we just reminisced. <laughs> it was great. Um, what did you think of Game of Thrones season 8? Let me, let me, let me compose myself because that I could do a whole live stream about my thoughts of the ending of season eight. Oh, hi, Claire. Thank you for making it. Love your makeup. Thank you, Patsy. LOL. Um, it was trash, but there were certain elements I liked. So like mountain versus uh, the hound. Fantastic. Oh, thank you, Claire. Thank you. You're so nice. I love you. Um, Queen of the North, we stand. Like, I still think about these Game of Thrones prophecies at least once a day. And it's amazing how, you know, you spend eight seasons, like, theorizing about a prophecy you heard. And they just throw it out the window. The dog survived. Ghost did survive. He did. We stand. I missed a lot of chat while I was on that whole tirade. I'm sorry. That could be a whole, whole thing. I don't care for Christmas. I don't like it because it's, it's one of my buddy's birthdays. I feel like obligatory hanging out with my family. I feel that. Ooh, Madison, can't wait for Halloween. Oh, there we go. Oh yeah, the best part is is right next to Pets Bar. Oh, you can get, you know, your food and everything else. One-stop shop. 
Oh my god, <laughs> the stupid cheese table was all I could think about. <laughs> my friend Adrian's, he, he's the one who used to work at the store at me. Girl, that jeans table still haunts me these days. D and D are canceled, but I'm still gonna watch the prequels. There's one. There's two prequels going on right now. I'm gonna watch them both. I know that for sure. Targnation is ready for two new Targaryen women to stand, and I am one of those people. Rito made me aggressively hate Christmas. You ain't the only one, sis. I worked Christmas Eve last year. And people were like coming in like 10 minutes before we closed. And it was like 6 o'clock Christmas Eve. And I'm like, why are you here? Go home. Like, why are you shopping? Jesus. Uh, last year, we're in the middle of October. It was kind of lame. This year, we were in the middle of a move again. Oh, that sucks, Madison. Oh, I'm watching the prequels. <laughs> Same. I'm very excited. George R. R. Martin's like, I don't know. I'm kind of hoping for the Targaryen one to happen first, just because Targaryen Nation deserves it, okay? okay? We were done very dirty in the last season, so, you know, take that. Oh, is my lipstick messed up? No, she's cute, she's cute. Ugh. My husband worked at Kroger during Christmas and people were throwing a fit because they closed early. Like, sis, go home and enjoy the holidays. Yeah, I don't, I don't understand why people, like, go out on holidays. Like, I'm just, I'm just like, oh, We were done so dirty, I can't. Facts, facts, facts. Dragons, can't wait for more dragons. Winslow, Winslow really looks up to Drogon, you know? I mean, did he destroy half the city? Yeah. But Winslow's like, I still stand. God, love you so much. Queen, have to go. Okay, bye, rat tails. Have fun. Have a good rest of the day. I don't know what time or night. I don't know. Whenever you want, you know. But, yeah, no, people love to, like, go shopping at, like, weird times. And I'm like, ugh. Oh, 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 oh. Um, here we go. Here we go. How awkward do you feel when you first started YouTube? Like, before the first few, how did you get and stay motivated i felt horribly awkward in my first video like it's at like this weird angle and it's really dark because i didn't have a ring light i was trying to use like natural light and i was like oh my god hi guys it's like confidence on camera is definitely learned through doing and if you're nervous at first girl everybody's nervous at first that's why so many people go back so many years later and laugh at themselves for being so nervous after they've, you know, made it. Stay motivated, that's like, it's hard. I'm not gonna lie, it's hard to stay motivated with YouTube and stuff like that, because it can, you never know how it's gonna turn out. Um, but if you really believe in you and yourself and your content, you will sort of continue to um, evolve, you know? Because here's the thing, like, you, like, if I make a bad video, I learn from it and just know everybody's made bad videos some of my videos I look at now and I'm like wow that's trash but you live and learn okay miss a lot of chat okay my boyfriend worked at Walmart the one year they had to work Thanksgiving and explicit really sucked yeah my store was open for the first time on Thanksgiving and no one came <laughs> they just send people home after like two hours because they were like no one's coming why are we open um, I also worked for Kroger. Okay, but he did do it for his mom. Lizzo would do it that too. Facts are facts, Claire. Facts are facts. I looked out last Christmas Eve and had it off, but the one before I was in home care worker. But I got a bit, so I'm done with work, winter holidays. Yeah. I gotta go to class. Okay, bye. I left it myself in general. I mean, that's good. I do the same thing. Do you need a camera to do you? YouTube or would your phone work? Your phone would work. That's kind of all I have, but I want to start doing vids about my leopard gecko and axolotl. Yeah, you really could just do it on your phone. Most phones, like anything of like an iPhone 5, you'd probably be fine with. <sighs> Sorry, I had to burp. I don't like burping. Um, a phone would work fine. The audio does get a little weird and a little wonky sometimes. So just be very careful of the audio, but you could absolutely do, your, do it on your phone, like, and then just import it on your computer and do it there. I have a lot of footage that is from my phone, so it's possible. 
<laughs> nice answer, LOL, LOL, hashtag motivational speaker. My rates are very high. <laughs> I have exactly one YouTube video and it's 30 seconds. My baby riding my turtles back that was filmed with my sister's eye. <laughs> three. Oh my god. Brianna, who's your favorite queen? There you go, Brianna. Toad. I had a feeling you met Toad. Nerd girl, I had a feeling you met Toad. This is just how... That's just a... That's just a metaphor for my life. I sometimes do just sit here with, like, my Trixie and Katya and just think of, like, wow. Life's weird. <laughs> Whoops. Did I cover Winslow? I did not. He's good. Ugh. You know, maybe a faux fur coat wasn't the best. Okay, but it's cute, you know? I loved the look. I'll sweat for fashion. All right, there's a couple more. Whoops, oh, Mayo. Who is the name? Okay, yeah. So, ugh. My hair's starting to grow back, though. I love me some late night. Oh, oh. I was watching, ah, uh, like, right before I went live, because I, I finished, I, guys, so these lashes, these are the lashes from the last video that gave me so much trouble that took me like an hour to get on. Put them on first try this time. Can you make my hair go back? Um, I will try to find a spell for you, Jim. I will try. I cannot make any promises, though. Um, what was I talking about? I don't know. Also, it's 88 degrees in the desert. I'm freezing. Mood. Oh my god, me. I love it when my mom is still like. It's been 22 years. I'm 22. Years. And I'll walk around with a blanket in the house when like the AC's blasting. My mom's like, You're cold? As if it's like a new thing. And I'm like, I've been complaining I'm cold since I was like in the womb. Mom, like, why? I don't know why this is a question anymore. But hopefully the maybe the AC will come on later. Let's see. What do you do in a situation where your beard your cousin has two beard dragons? What might be Oh, your 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 cousin has terrible animal care. Um I mean you can try to talk to their parents, tell them like, hey, this could you know what you should do. You should be like, hey, you know, if you don't change this, you could waste a lot of money on vet care. Cause if they're on sand they could get impacted. And that's a very, very expensive vet visit, okay? Winslow's never had impaction, but he has had a lot of internal parasites, which have cost me a lot of money. So maybe go at it from a financial angle. You know, adults tend to tend to listen to the cash money. I missed something. It's 68. Oh my god, 65 and you're in shorts? I can't relate. <laughs> can't relate. That's like... That's like the dead of winter for me, where I live. Sorry I'm burping, but at least I won't have a caffeine headache later. Are you a person that one, goes to Ren Fair, makes fun of Ren Fairs, both, doesn't know what I'm talking about. Renaissance Fairs? Um, I cannot, I'm cold reading that. <laughs> Same. Like Renaissance Fairs? I've been to Renaissance Fair. I went to one when I was like eight. It was cute. It, like, I don't go anymore though. Um, they had one, but I think it just got too hot. <laughs> well, my cousin's really adamant about thinking he's complete right with it, things. You know, like some people just think they're right all the time. So, Northern Maine, it's 50 degrees. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. I'm 23 and do that. I haven't been warm since the 1800s. <laughs> Hi, Hannah. A potato. Same. But, yeah, no, always cold, which is why I, I own, like, two pairs of shorts. I'm still wearing black leggings, and I wore these all summer, because, like, even if it's hot outside, that doesn't mean it's not cold inside. You know what I mean? My hatred of the Midwest keeps me warm. <laughs> It's like a nice little pit on the inside. Just, it just burns, you know. I get you. I get you. I see you. <sighs> what are you doing? You're stressing me out. Ugh. Black leggings are nearly a crack addiction for me. 
I wear them about 90% of the time, so I get you. I'm always so warm that my friends treat me like a space here. Ugh, I love that. I'm on lunch at work, and it's about to end, but I just stopped to say hi. Oh, thank you, Kelsey. Thank you for stopping by. In Indiana, it's 70 degrees. I think that's 70s. Not terrible. I'm so comfortable this time because there's a breeze. Oh, cute. Also, the Coke is so relatable. Oh, thank you. Have you watched Killing Eve? I explain the premise to me. It sounds familiar. I don't think I've ever watched it though. Is it a sad show? I don't like sad shows. Like my friends, like you should watch The Handmaid's Tale, and I'm like, no, thank you. How dare Jeremy for not being here? I know, Jeremy. Lucifer. I've heard good things about that show, but I don't know. It's so good. It is. Lately, I've been watching Disenchantment season two. Um, I did this thing in the first season where I watched every episode within the day. So I have waited since they dropped the first season for the second season. So now I'm trying to like, I'm only watching two episodes at a time. Let's see. Oh, I was thinking the same thing, but there's respect. <laughs> Put some respect on my name, Jeremy. Put some respect on my name. Thank you very much. I'm not down for cold for how, oh, Canada, girl, oh, no, no ma'am, no ma'am, no ma'am. Watching her American Horror Story for the 10th time. What's your favorite season? I wish I had time for shows. I barely have time for anything. <laughs> um, yeah, I, can't. Canada's really pretty good for in the summer, and it seems like a nice place, but I don't think I could ever live there. It's too cold. Murder House and Coven. I feel like Coven's everybody's favorite season. My favorite season has always been Hotel, though. I'm in, I'm in the very small minority. Murder, Murder House was good. Phone's dying, but I love you. You're amazing. Oh, thank you, Claire. Thank you for coming. Thank you. Um, but no, Murder House was good. I, don't, I, I really resonated with the themes of um, Hotel, I think. Also, I mean, Lady Gaga. My queen. Asylum, Asylum was good, girl. I love Asylum. Let's see. Oh, I missed some chat. Dude, are you watching any cartoons? Disenchantment is actually a cartoon. It is made by the same people who did Futurama. So Matt Goring and a couple other people. It's really good. Archer's always a really good time. Been rewatching that since, I don't know, like three years now. Futurama, obviously. Um, Rick and Morty. You know, the usual, the usual up there's. Um, asylum, oh yeah. Oh, you like Freak Show and Hotel. Oh, Gaga is so great. Hotel was really good. Asylum was pretty good. I wasn't the biggest fan of Freak Show, but I didn't hate it. Yeah, Freak Show was like, I love the idea and I love Jessica Lang. It's just like, it got very chaotic there at the end. I think that's where they lost me. You know, let's see. I'm too much of a wimp to watch American Horror Story. It's okay, girl. Don't watch Roanoke, though, if you ever watch one. Because that one, that one scared me, and I've, I've been watching it. Animu? What's Animu? Is that an anime? So Killing Eve is basically about a female MI6 agent and female Russian assassin. They're basically in a cat and mouse game, and they're obsessed with each other. And it's amazing. That sounds interesting. I love Jessica Lang. Who doesn't love her? I'm pretty sure Rick and Morty is coming... Rick and Morty's coming back, I think, in October or November. So we're very close. Thank you. Who's the creators of Rick and Morty? Oh my god, I just forgot it. Justin Roiland. Thank you, Justin Roiland. We love you. Um, oh, it's an anime. I, I don't watch much anime. The only anime I've, the only anime I've ever really watched is Dragon Ball Z. <laughs> Let's see. Asylum is my favorite American Horror Story. I miss Jessica Lange. Everybody misses Jessica Lange. Oh, she was such a queen. Uh, Roanoke wasn't the best. I liked the concept, though. Like, I love how they really, like, took the format and made it their own. You know what I mean? And the story was interesting. It was definitely kind of weird. But I liked, I liked, I liked the change of formats. I haven't... Where did you get your hoops? I need them in my life. Forever 21. I don't pay more than $10 for hoops because I don't have anything else to prove. I'm obsessed with horror movies, so I love any creepy shows. I wish I could watch horror movies because I love like the concept of horror movies. But I have like, like the second 
I turn off my lights, it's just like instantly every bloody gory thing I've ever seen in my life um, pops up in my brain. So that's why I have to sleep with the TV on. It's not healthy, but it's fine. Let's see. Yes, Mama Monster, how do you like feel about her makeup line? I have not watched any of the reviews because I've been kind of busy, but there's a couple colors that I for sure want. I just didn't want to wait for the pre-order because I'm one of those people who's like, all right, if I'm going to pay for something, I want it ASAP. But I'll probably wind up buying them anyways because there's a couple colors that are just absolutely beautiful. You know what I mean? Um, Pickle Rick, yes. Killing Eve is also <laughs> very gay. Thank you for the commentary, Derek. We love. I'm obsessed with horror movies. Oh, wait, I already read that one. Definitely thought it was just thought. Oh, 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 you thought it was like well grown now. It just wasn't your favorite. I get you, Hannah. I get you. Just watched Enemy Built Horror for the millionth time. I've heard good things about it. Again, I feel like sleeping later tonight. You know what I mean? I always needed sound when sleeping because I get night terrors where I feel like I'm being haunted or hunted. Ooh. Hello, Crochet Princess. Thank you for joining us. Um, yeah, I get you. Hi, sorry I'm late. Don't worry, Riley. It's cool you came up. I need some spooky suggestions to watch. Any suggestions? It Chapter 2? I mean, Bill Skarsgård is a snack, so. That's my only commentary for that movie, by the way. People keep asking me if I've seen it. <laughs> I keep having to explain, like, I can't watch horror movies. But Bill Skarsgård is a snack. And they're like, oh. But also, same. Love the makeup. Oh, thanks, Queen. It's like a Gwen Stefani ode. I loved her. Like as a child, she was my... Do you have any unpopular opinions about RuPaul's Drag Race? Naomi Smalls deserved better. <laughs> Thoughts on Taylor Goldeen? She's been back and seems to be doing very good in recovery. I mean, I hope she stays sober. Like, I don't want anyone, like, struggling with that kind of stuff. But, I don't know, I've kind of been avoiding a lot of... Like, I haven't watched any of her videos or anything like that. There's just, like, a lot of drama. And I'm just, like... I'm not the de facto drama channel of pet tube anymore. All right, I missed a lot of chat. Um, horror movies are my recommendation. Also a bit dumb, but would Firebelly Frogs work in a five gallon? Don't know. <laughs> I'm a terrible person to ask animal questions. Favorite Gwen Stefani song? Either Underneath It All, or wait, wait, Gwen Stefani or No Doubt? You give me life. Oh, thank you, Riley. Thank you. By the way, no shade. Gwen Stefani. I really have been listening to my wrath has gone to bed now I'm off. Okay, bye Jess. Thank you for joining us. Um, although no doubt slaps. Facts. I've been listening to Make Me Love You a lot lately. And I don't know. What you're waiting for is or yeah. I'm just gonna go with Make Me Love You, just because I have like 10 million songs I like right now. And they always change, and that's just the one I've been listening to lately. I don't know why. Bro, I don't- oh, whoops. I don't know how you're not overwhelmed by the comments. The most I've ever gotten on stream was 10 out of the overwhelmed. I'm a Gemini. I'm, I'm moving fast, always going a million miles an hour. Is it ADD? I don't know, maybe. That's what- oh, 10 people, not comments. I mean, there's only like 18 people here. It's fine. Maybe it's the ADD. I don't even know if that was a... Do y'all remember back in, like, the 2000s when that was, like, the thing? Like, everybody was like, oh, my God. ADD. Yeah, I was one of those kids. Are you looking forward to Jeffree Star and Shane's... Yes! I know that people are like, I don't really want to do, like, Jeffree Star. Like, I don't care about that. But I'm so intrigued by, like, the behind the scenes. That's what I want to know. I want to know... Because... Like, they were all, like, like, James, Charles, uh, Jeffrey, and Shane all did, like, that, the original Jeffrey series, like, together. So, I want to know, like, what happened? Like, what, did they talk to Tati? Did they talk to James afterward? Did James and Jeffrey maybe, like, talk privately, make things up? Like, I want to know the tea. Well... He 
was eating spilled salad. Wait, whoa, 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 I missed a lot. Oh, well, go-to outfit or stuck in style? Black cotton leggings from Forever 21. Um, some sort of shirt, usually with a graphic design. Today, I chose the Queen Britney Spears. And then the rest is really just accessories. So maybe get, like, some $8 hoops and a bunch of jewelry. Make sure that I like... I like my jewelry to match though. Like I like if I wear gold hoops, I'll wear gold jewelry. If I wear silver hoops, I'll wear silver jewelry. That's like my only thing. And then you know, just like build up. Watch some queer eye. There we go. Tan France is iconic. Let's see. I'm a Scorpio. Ooh. Love Shane series. Like, what's the tea sis? I'm ready. Also, if you're talking about the sister scandal, I'm ready for that tea. Shane is my dad to watch anything. And there's that's they're all just to say on the matter. Yeah, no, I'm really excited. The pig mirrors, though. Sis. I need that. Um, but no, I'm very excited. I... I don't know, I did, like, a whole video on the James Charles thing. Um, just, like, what I thought about it. Oh, hi. Is it Genethy? Genethy? Genethy. Hello. The pig bag. I like the pig bag, but I... I was thinking with backpacks. I'd be with backpacks. But I love the design. I think it was so cute. Um, but, like, the sister scandal. That was crazy. Um, where do you buy your lashes? There's, like, this specialty store in my mall that's not, like, a love you but have to go take a depression mac. Okay, bye, potato. And trust me, been there, done that. Um, there's, like, a specialty store in the mall, but it's, like, a, like a family-owned store. So, yeah. That's where I buy my lashes. Yeah, I was talking about- Oh, Shane series. Also, whatever palette I will be getting. I will be getting it as well. <laughs> we can see that, um, I really like Jeffree's formulas when it comes to eyeshadows. I know people are gonna, like, drag me, but they're fun. Um, yeah, I'm very excited about the series. I would love to see a more in-depth view of the beauty community than what we've been presented or like that would anyone else has really done because he's been filming for a year you know and this is nine parts my guys nine parts it's like oh i'm so excited honestly don't know how i feel about shane dawson i for sure don't mess with jeffrey but i'm going to see how it goes yeah i mean you're not alone I like Shane. I like his point of view and the way he presents things. And he's a good storyteller to me. And I think that he covers things in depth. You know what I mean? Like, he doesn't just do, like, one video on it and then he's done. Like, he really... Let's see. Oh, what does my tattoo say? Oh, it's a Florence and the Machine lyric. Can y'all see it? It says, did I build a ship to wreck? It's my only tattoo and I love her. She's cute. I may have to get it redone soon, but I've had it since I was like 18, so I've, I've had it for four years. Oh, um, I feel that his makeup is actually incredibly well made. It is. They should have just made a movie like I'd buy it. Netflix, hello. Do you remember like a couple months ago when YouTube was like, oh, we're putting a lot of money in like developing stuff. And I'm like, you're not going to give him that money to like Shane? Like, I'm just... Because, like, he comes up with things that other people just can't or won't. Are you going to poop on me? No? Okay. Can't or won't cover. Like, the Jake Paul series. I know a lot of people were like, oh, he's, like, overdoing sociopath. But I didn't mind it. Oh, yep, he's pooping. Okay. Hold, please. Are we done? Oh, nope. Your taste in music is so good. Oh, thank you, Abby. Okay, I'm waiting for Winslow to stop pooping. Love, Jeffrey. I don't use makeup. Uh, but my wife does. Oh, that's cool. Um, Netflix or Prime? The only thing I watch on Prime is Dragula. So I'm gonna have to say Netflix. Um. Oh my god. You pooped this morning, too? How do you have this much poop? Hold for dragon poop. <laughs> Plays elevator music. Oh, I wish I could, but I'd probably get claimed by something. Ugh, smells awful in here. 
are you like this? He also tried to poop directly on me. So, thank you for that, Winslow. I'm a Netflix person because as a responsible doll as I am, I spilled my parents' account. Stole my parents' account too. LOL, El Mio. He's such a sc petty, scaly puppy. 100%. Um, oh, hi, Super Hugs. Hi, Feel. Beard Dragon poop smell is the <laughs> Same. I don't wish it on my enemies either. And, ugh. He pooped this morning. I don't know why he had to poop again. Little evil guy. With Prime, you get free shipping, true. On all Amazon sales, and I love to feed my depression halls. <laughs> Did you mean depression halls? Because it's the same. Um, no, what, actually, you know what I really, you know what, I, I love Hulu a little bit more. I feel like Hulu is kind of underrated. Madison's like, yes, what I miss, it's a good, good day working at the pet store. Oh, we're just, I'm, there's no real theme to this. I'm just talking. Um, Hulu I think is very underrated. They have a lot of the Fox shows. They have the X-Files. They have Archer. And Futurama, which is pretty much all I watch, so. It's cute. Hulu is like the stepsister of them all. That's true. Yeah, Hulu. It's weird because Hulu has better anime. Anime guys. There we go. Hulu has Sailor Moon. You know what else they have? They have Jimmy Neutron. Um, they have the old X-Men series. Did anyone else watch the old X-Men series? Like the animated one. That one slapped. Sorry, I'm, I'm keeping an eye on Winslow. Has a pretty green theme too. I mean, that's true. They have Seinfeld, which I've rewatched more than I like. The original. I wish they put Spongebob on Netflix. Honestly, they might. Um, I hope they do too. Does Fox own Nickelodeon? I don't know who owns who, so it's like hard to keep up with. As always, gorgeous. Oh, you. I tried. As in, I put makeup on only to uh, do this live, so. <laughs> Sorry, I'm still kind of angry at Winslow for trying to poop on me. But I think that's. How many other people's dragons have pooped on them? Because I've had Winslow. Winslow has pooped on my hair. He's pooped on my shoulder. He's pooped on my foot. SpongeBob is on UK Netflix. Ugh. Jealous. I know Fox is owned by Disney, yes. Fox wins a lie. <laughs> oh my god. PSA, tip your servers. Riley's, you know, out here. I thought Disney bought Fox, I could be wrong. I th I'm pretty sure they do. Mine pees on me every time I pick up, pick him. Oh, he pees on you. <laughs> Winslow's done that a lot too. Oh, your friend group always, oh, your friend group shares a collective Hulu, Netflix, and Amazon Prime account. Cute. One time I was holding my beardy, standing up, she put on me. Same. Scales in the snow, hello. Do you curl your hair? No, sis, this is all natural. This is 100% bog witch hair. Oh, thank you, Armored Wings, for coming. Hello. Yeah, no, this is real, like, Irish bog witch hair right here. I don't curl it. I just wet it and it does this. I was going to straighten my hair. Watching from work. Oh, great. Are you on your break? Sorry, there's something weird on my lips. <sighs> Very preoccupied with my lipstick because I used to wear red lipstick like all the time. And now I usually only really wear a nude color, but it's cute. No, but I'm all alone till close. Hey, you know, that's a party. I wish I was all alone sometimes. Actually, yesterday, no, when did I work? Tuesday. Tuesday I worked. Okay, honestly, older Pepsi. Coke. 100% Coke every single day of the week. No matter what. Dusty heart Dusty, if you're in the chat, show yourself. We'll fight. Um my bird poops on me all the time. My snakes don't poop. Gecko hasn't yet. And when I had my bearded dragon, they never pooped on me. Maybe I'm lucky with animals. Maybe. 
Beans never pooped on me. Mr. Peanut Butter's never pooped on me. Baby Spice has never pooped on me. Archer probably wishes he could poop on me because he hates me. Um, oh, hello, Sarcastic Ghostly. Hello. Um, I missed a... Okay. With my natural curls were like yours. Mine just turned into a hot mess. Depends on how you take care of them. Have you tried a texturizing spray? Like after you brush it out and then using a texturizing spray and then also using like a light leave-in. Sometimes that helps. I'm very, I'm, <laughs> I've had this hair for a while, so. Just be glad your hair isn't curly and faded green. I was nicknamed the, the Swamp Witch for, for a year. I was goth in high school, so I'm pretty, and my hair is jet black, so I'm pretty sure they called me like a goth witch behind my back, but it's fine. Jim, I will fight you. Um, Coke tastes better. It does. Couldn't handle my curls. I just keep my head shaved. I mean, that just sounds like easy maintenance, sis. Like, you do you. You do you. You know what I'm saying? Um, yeah, we're just arguing about Coke and Pepsi now. Coke is supreme, and I love it. I'm down to throw it down. Next live stream is going to be me and Jim fighting. I know you guys just want to see me and Winslow fighting, but I'm afraid PetTube will cancel me unanimously. I mean, I've already kind of muted myself out, so it doesn't really matter. Winslow, come here, we'll fight. Why does McDonald's Coke taste better than Cane Coke? Okay, that is 100% correct. I have gone to McDonald's specifically, specifically for Coca-Cola because it just, it does taste different. My brother once told me why, don't remember why they like process it different or something like that. I don't know. He's like a chef and does stuff. All right, yep. Um, I'm drinking a Sierra Mist. You do you, sis. You do you. My edit, my video is all stalled. I'm gonna skedaddle. Okay, bye. Dr. Pepper. I love a good Dr. Pepper. I'm trying to grow up my hair to donate to cancer, and my curls are killing me. Girl, trust me, I feel you. It's also hard because sometimes you feel like your hair is just not growing when it's curly, and then you like kind of pull on it. And then you're like, oh, no, it's been growing for a while. It's just the way it is. Um, it's the aluminum can. I got my beardy cheese puppet dog bed today. Winslow has a cat bed. It's orthopedic. Not for Christmas. Even though he completely ruined it when he pooped in it, but whatever. Mexican Coca-Cola. Mexican Coca-Cola is pretty good, I'm not gonna lie. Or I've had it before. McDonald's paid a lot of money for it to taste better. Each system is like a multi-million dollar system. The straws are specifically designed at their big length to create maximum taste value okay i'm not gonna fact check it do you guys remember that meme from like reddit a little while ago where somebody like put some statement they're like i don't know if that's real or not but i'm not gonna fact check it so i'm gonna upload it me um soda tastes better when it has real sugar true remind me the scent oh okay i want an orthopedic bag why do animals always have cooler things than me Oh my god, I saw, I, I didn't buy it for Winslow, though I wanted to buy it for Winslow. It was $70, it was like one of those fancy couches people put, like rich people put at the end of their bed, and it's got like the curl, and then it goes down there, and it was for dogs, and I was like, I want that for my lizard, because he's bougie and petty. All right. Ooh, conspiracy theory up. I really want to try McDonald's Coke now, but can't I only have diet it's okay booba twitter or, or insta for what purpose i'm gonna say twitter for the memes my hair is naturally super thick and wavy it was down to my back and i had to cut it because i was getting migraines now i just go with the short pixie lazy style you do you madison you know like do whatever you want with your hair it's your hair i'm weird and like coke zero my mom swears coke zero and coke taste the same it does not, no matter how many times she's like, what are you talking about? She tastes exactly the same. I'm talking as if she's here, but she's like, who are you? All right. Orange vanilla Coke is a sin. I don't like orange flavored stuff. Like remember those orange cream popsicles they would give you in school? I was like, no ma'am, no ma'am. Just keep it, I don't want it. Favorite dog breed. 
Diet Coke better than Coke Zero? Honestly, probably. Oh, oh, yep, yeah, see? They agree. Favorite dog, I don't have a favorite dog breed. I just like dogs. Sadie, Sadie's my favorite dog breed. I bring her in here, but she's way, like this bathroom is very small and she's a very thick lady. I just sent you the link, okay. Um, orange vanilla Coke is so nasty. I wanted to like, oh, I wanted to like, oh, okay. We'll be going. I don't actually know when I'm gonna end this live stream. I've been going for an hour, maybe like an hour and a half. It's not like I'm doing anything. Warren, howdy, how, howdy, Warren, howdy. How you feel? Um, oh my God, I saw a cowboy hat yesterday for dogs and I almost bought it for Sadie. But then I remembered, I think she has one. It's pink. So she should probably dig it out for Halloween because she looks very cute. I had an Argentine Mastiff, but I want to find a good trainer for that type of dog first. That's a good idea. All right, gotta head out. Okay, bye, Abby. Thanks. Bye. How are the pet rocks doing? Phenomenally. Um, yeah, they're doing great. You know, I'm, I can honestly say that I am the greatest rock breeder on YouTube. If anyone else wants to fight me about it, pull up. A bulldog. I love bulldogs. Dude, I saw a leopard gecko on Etsy. I might need. Oh, a cowboy hat for a leopard gecko. That sounds adorable. My parents have three Alaskan Malamutes. Don't those have like a lot of hair? I know what you're thinking, Megan. You would know about a lot of hair, wouldn't you? I would. I was told silver and drug Megan both work. <laughs> I'm gonna say sober Megan just because drug Megan's messy. <laughs> when do we get an update video on the baby rocks? I don't know. Eventually. Maybe one day. Ooh. Oh, I like wiped off half my lipstick. Got a Leo this weekend because someone didn't want her anymore. So now she's just chilling in my lap eating some super worms. Aw, sounds so wholesome. We love wholesome content on this channel. It's a Christian channel. I need a cowboy hat for my parent, but I think she would kill me. Yeah. They might. I don't know. I don't know anything about birds. That's my contribution. That's that's the that's the thought. That's the whole thought. I'm gonna put on some lip gloss real quick. Winslow, if you could not. Megan, you still need Oh yeah, I forgot about that. Ugh, okay. DM me. Fixed it. Oh, I know that people that talk about birds that don't know anything about them. Shade. Um, oh, no, 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 no. How's Archer doing? I have two ball pythons. Archer's great. Um, he just wants to sit inside all day and soak up warmth until I feed him. So I'm assuming he's fine. Um, Let's see. Oh my god, I want a reptile, but mom said no. Oh boy, I almost lost track of time. Hi! Hi, Sage and Scales. Hello. I'm sorry, I'm busy and want to hang out. I wish this life was later. Stay on for another hour. <laughs> Thank you for stopping by to say hello again, Anna. It might be live for another hour. I don't know. Because um, I'm not going to lie, it's not like I actually do things with my life. Except clean up Winslow poop. I love birds, but they're a lot of work. They are. Sounds about right. Um, my grandma had a bird, and when they were staying with us, um, I wanted to kill the bird. Android or Apple? Apple. But. What are you doing? Mr. Man. Oh, I'm sorry if you can hear my dog in the background. Okay, I think he's done. I want a snake, but my dad thinks that they're the spawn of Satan. I'll come back in, pos in approximately three seconds and say hello again. I love it. Favorite ah uh, moment. <laughs> okay, okay. So when I first started watching ah, uh, the thing that made me laugh the hardest was the episode about death 
where Katya recounted how she wanted to die. Like, step by step. It was just... Just, it was just hilarious. Like, I was in... I was at work, sitting at, sitting in the break room, and I was, like, on the floor laughing. Okay. Okay, okay. Miss a bunch of chat, probably about how I said I kind of wanted to kill a bird. A doggo? Yes. Large doggo. Almost a human. I work at PetSmart, let me tell you, it's hell. Don't doubt it, sis. Trust me, I know, I know the retail game. Grew up with an umbrella cockatoo and can't stand birds. All it did was scream. That's what this bird did as well. I don't remember what it was. I think it was a love bird. I don't know. Here's all you need to know about birds. They love you and want nothing more than to be, but then they hate you a second later. If you take something, they should be playing away from them. That sounds like a dog too. I live for Katya, whatever she is to be. <laughs> did you see that one episode where she like admitted she was like, she's like, all I do is like interrupt you while interrupting her. I love it. Fellow PetSmart employee here. Hello, fellow retail employees. I just know I understand your saltiness. I know you wanted to punch a customer today, and I'm proud that you didn't, because you kept your job. Because trust me, sis, some people really test you. Um, a lot of work, but they love you. Yeah, I don't think I could ever own a bird. I just don't think it's in my future. It's not in the cards. I... I like the peace and quiet, and I don't know if you know this, like, even with, like, Winslow's little, like, and trying to poop on me, still, you know, and no noise. No noise. That was about as loud as he gets. We stand. Alright, Mr. Budget Chat. Alright. Yeah, no one regrets leaving retail. Yell at someone today. I invite everyone to watch. I'm going to have to vicariously live through me. I wish I could yell at people every day. Um, I love that they know each other so well. They aren't even mad at things that, like, the friendship they aspire to have. Yeah, same. Um, I used to work at Bed Bath & Beyond. Oh my god, people sometimes. I get you. I have two jobs, retail and serving, lol. The depression is real. Yeah, no, I get it. I'm, I'm sh servers, servers and food service people probably just get it, get it just as bad as the retail workers. I just, I've actually worked retail. My brother works in food service. He's a chef. I work at local pet store that specializes in reptiles. I think I knew that. Yeah. Winslow. I don't trust him. <laughs> I mentioned that. Oh, thank God you're still alive. Yes, Connor, I'm still here. Waitressing killed my soul. I 100% believe you. Oh, now my mom's home. I'm sorry if it's like really loud right now, but okay, gotta go. Bye, Riley. All right, and farm boy store in Canada, but I don't still have that job. Oh, that's cute. There's a place called Farm Boy in Canada. Not Canadian, but there's a lot of Canadians that like come to my like where I live though. Like a lot of them. Probably just don't see them during the winter. They're like, oh, there's no old people in Canada. It's because they're where I live, yelling at me. It's great. The job I had in the shoe department was honestly worse than the dishwasher job I had. I work at my dad's farm, and thank God I don't have to deal with customers. Yeah, because then you just, like, you know, yell at your dad, and then it's just a... I don't know. Retail made me bitter. Now I can mace people. Oh, wow. Worked at a trust stop. I actually lived it there. There were some people... That were just straight a-holes. Yeah, people are garbage everywhere. I used to work in a small stationery shop, and the worst thing is greeted people when they came in and most of the time got no reply. Oh, I love that. So I was talking about animals with my best friend, and she hung up on me, so now I'm here. Okay, cool. Cool, cool. Favorite uh intro. <laughs> so between you know, I rock in a hard place. What is my, oh man, I think, what is my, I, cause here's the thing, when I graduated last June, no May, me and my friend did like Trixie and Katya um, hats, like caps, and the one I loved was, I, that's the, I'm the chemical burn from the spyware program is the one that I used because the one I liked 
was very inappropriate and I was like I feel like they're not I was there you were Jim oh my god there's so many people okay <sighs> Connor we're talking about Drag Race I'm sorry if you have no knowledge of, of it but there's a show called uh on YouTube if you want to laugh Farm Boys at the grocery store um fave energy drink I cannot drink energy drinks anymore because they give me heart palpitations um it says he was too busy to say hi oh that sucks um but I think my the fav my favorite that's off the top of my head of the uh intros is probably I'm the self-inflicted stigmata wound to get you attention on Sunday no no here it is here I, I, I just didn't know if I could do this one hi I'm the visual depiction of untreated mental illness because that's me I have no knowledge about video games, music, animals, and Pokemon. Oh, you have... Have you played the new uh, Link's Awakening? Oh, thank you, Sage. Because I really want it, but I had to pay rent this this paycheck, so I couldn't get it, but... I haven't seen any reviews on it. Is it good? Anyone else play Zelda games? We were talking about that the other day in um, Jeremy's live stream, because he's a big Zelda fan. Which... <laughs> I heard that it was good. Oh, it's amazing. Oh, okay. oh yeah, Jim, you have it. It's amazing? Okay. I'll probably buy it next payday. Unless I have to buy these boots. I'm a complex human person. Yeah, I like that one too. It's funny. Sorry, Minji. I've been playing Ocarina on time on my Nintendo 64. Oh, that's fun. I haven't played the new one, but I'm getting Twitch for Pokemon. Wait, you're getting like a, a Twitch for Pokemon? Are you streaming Pokemon on Twitch? Oh, on the Switch! Are you getting the new one? Because I have played Pokemon Go. It's pretty, I mean, Pokemon Let's Go. Really fun on the Switch. Um, I'm probably gonna get the new one that's coming out. Like, November? It's coming out in November, I'm pretty sure. I'm getting that one too. It's gonna be fun. It's gonna be a fun time. Do you play Butterlands? I have not. Um, like, I... Here, here's my history with video games. Like, when I was a kid, I don't know the differences on that. Oh, yeah. When I was a kid, like, the only games I really played were the ones my brother got, got bored with, and then gave to me. Oh, thank you, Jam. The unsung hero of the, uh, Switch account. <laughs> um, so I would just play whatever game he get, would get tired of. So I, there's, like, a lot of games that I never played because he just never had them. Like, um, Spyro. I really want to play Spyro or... Like Crash Bandicoot and stuff like that. Or Mario Kart. I've never played Mario Kart. I know, drag me. Um, but the games that he did get like tired of was like Sims or Animal Crossing, girl. I am so excited for Animal Crossing. Can I just... I love Animal Crossing. And I didn't really start getting into Legend of Zelda until I brought my Switch. Until I bought my Switch. And I started playing Breath of the Wild. And I was like, oh my god. This is why everybody's excited for Zelda games, because this is, like, a great game. So, Gar Mario Kart has an app now, but I've heard that it's trash. I'm from Twitter. Twitter thinks it's trash. Okay, let me go all the way back up. While I was on my... Here we go. I've been playing... Okay. Alright. The Switch is life. I can't wait for new Pokemon. I know. And wants to have a good time look up Majora's Mask meaning on here it's kind of wild I've seen like a lot of like I, I fell down a rabbit hole once when they announced the new Breath of the Wild sequel I fell down the rabbit hole of Legend of Zelda um series it's a very in-depth very good watch not gonna lie very excited for the next game all right I just watch gamers because I can't afford games. It's okay. That's fun. Spyro on the Switch. Want to play it? Just haven't. The only play game I play is Minecraft. Minecraft is fun, my guy. I No shame in that. It's a deep rabbit hole indeed. <laughs> oh, yeah, you've probably been down it. But, ooh. Sorry, I had to slap my butt bite. It's gotten... It's not as bad anymore, but I think it was a wasp sting. We're talking about my butt bite. I'm sorry if it's gross. But it's, I think it's a wasp thing, but I don't remember, like, having beef with a wasp. Like, when my mom's like, oh, it's probably a wasp, and I'm like, 
when have I been around a wasp? Like, I don't, I, I think I remember. Let's see. I play Sims 4, love Sims. I have the pets pack. I kind of want the new, um, what's it called? Like the, the new one that's coming out with the witches. More of a PC gamer these days. That's cool, girl. There's a lot of fun games on PC. Um, does anyone else, has anyone else seen the, um, like the trailers for that goose game? <laughs> Somebody remixed it to, um, Lizzo's Juice because she said, blame it on the goose. So someone redid the trailer with that intro. It was inspiring. Gotta try to feed my new first baby hog nose. Any suggestions behind egg sifting? Um, eggs have always worked for me in the past. You could try braining, which is where you, you poke a hole in the brain and then you kind of squeeze it out a little bit and then it kind of comes out. Heard that's work. You can also try being sausages. Untitled Goose Game. Yes, the new, the, the goose simulator. We play as a goose. I watched Petey play the goose game earlier today. <laughs> it looks fun. Like, I'm not gonna lie, I might buy it. But it's hard. To, I don't have time for video games. Check out Snake Discovery for feeding videos. Yeah, Snake Discovery knows so much more than me. I mean, just so much more. Like, she's out here, like, doing... Oh, bye, Alexa, bye! She's out here, like, actual making content, and I'm just sitting in my pink bathroom <laughs> talking about how much I love Legend of Zelda and Gwen Stefani. In a Britney shirt, though. We stand. My mom actually did not recognize this when, when I first wore it. She's like, who's in your shirt? I'm like, Britney. She's like... Oh, that's just a really young picture of her, and I'm like, yeah, it's, it's Britney Spears. So I got congested all of a sudden. Winslow. She has toes. Who? Snake, snake Discovery? I would love a frog. That's the one pet I would actually probably get. It's Britney Beach. Overwatch is a great game for people that don't have time matches. They're only about eight minutes long. Oh, that's cute. The Reptile Channel. I was just talking about that with uh, Jim. Hello, Dylan. Hello. Um, we were just talking about, like, the exposed video that Exotic did on them. It's pretty gross. Um, which does sort of tie into my conspiracy theory from, like, two months ago about PetTube getting demonetized. So, hopefully YouTube doesn't uh, demonetize it. Because I know they, they present it as, like, oh, this is educational. It's like... So there's nope and hey page oh, she did a pretty great one too nice i know a couple people were i think i saw the pity page one but it was a while ago I, if it's a video i'm thinking of i remember watching a video where somebody like exposed it um i don't remember how much longer are you gonna be live i'm sorry i'm late isaiah it's cool i don't actually know how much longer i'm gonna be live because I don't do anything with my life, so could be a couple more minutes, could be another hour, I don't know. <sighs> Need to watch the episodic video. Pet tube seems to be leveling out a little bit. What do you mean? What did they Oh the reptile channel? It's like this I'm trying not to like like get like demonetized there. Pages came out, oh, okay, so this was, yeah, this is an old video I watched. I watched it, like, two months ago or something like that. Um, the husband requires food. Oh, have fun, bye. Um, oh, as far as drama seems to be calming down. Yeah, for sure. Um, it's, like, this weird channel that presents itself as, like, oh, we're educational, but it's actually got, like, a weird underlying issue that will get me demonetized. Or maybe I'm just not watching as much as anymore. I don't know. Oh, that was a good one. Gang. The two bullets ones on the hurting, lol. <laughs> yes, I've thoroughly yeeted myself. I feel great. Even though I feel really congested. What are you doing? Oh. I was walking through something. I thought he was like... I like cracked something. It was a really weird noise. I don't know. But let me fix my hair. Here we go. Lipstick still looks good. I haven't worn this lipstick in like months too, and I'm very impressed with it. It's 
a Maybelline lipstick too, so it's not like a super fancy lipstick. It's, it's, it's cute. Plantain poop mines. Are you gonna get octagon earrings? I don't, these are like seven size, so they're not quite octagons, but I would, I'd be interested because I do love these. Um, so if they came in an octagon shape, I'd probably buy them. I'm supposed to be a run by a guy who got banned from YouTube for his content. I would not doubt that. Crochet princess, I, it's very weird and I'm very worried about it. <laughs> Even my ex out of relationship one because you're getting one of our dudes. I feel like that's the most you've ever said eat, Jim. But no, I, I maybe go watch like Emzotic or Petty Page's video on it so you know. Don't give them any nonsense. <laughs> it's like a weird thing. You can watch it after after this live. I have a beardy and he is great. His name is Spike. Oh cute. Yeet test. That's going in my lexicon now. Eat tastic. What are you doing? I don't trust you. I don't trust you. You want to go in the bathroom? This is like the actual bathroom. Ooh, spooky out. Oh, even though it's only it's only like five or something like that. Cute. Maybe it'll rain. It smelled like rain earlier. Oh my god. Ooh, 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 ooh. Those earrings are adorable. If I wore them, my head would look like a stop sign. <laughs> I mean, they're definitely giving you some stop sign realness right now. Basically, snake and large snakes alive in one movie. Yeah. We need to see Bean. I think. Um, I think she's still sleeping, and even then, she doesn't really like. Um, the ring light. So I don't know. Maybe, maybe if I'm still alive in like a couple minutes, I'll, I'll get Mr. Peanut Butter or something like that because he doesn't mind the ring light. I'll just turn my ad lock if I need to watch someone I don't support. You can do that. Yeah, no, Queen Bee, she doesn't like, she's on bio, so she's very sensitive to light. Um, so much so that even like sometimes if I have like my light on and she's just out, like she tries to like find a spot, if I, even if I'm like trying to feed her. It's really weird. The doggos are out. They've been released. <sighs> He's not barking at anything either. That's what's great about it. That's what's so great about Bruce. You know, he just barks <laughs> for no reason. Oh shit, I need to do a lot of change for my beta. Aw. I had a beta fish. But it was I was in like high school when I had the beta fish. He lived forever though, like, well not forever, he lived for like three years, which is a pretty good while wow, for betas, so. And he was full grown when I got him. Yeah, my snake Mighty Python. <laughs> Opinions on cats. I would like a cat, however, um, my dog Sadie um, hates cats, so I cannot get a cat because she hates them. Dominations. Do you still doubt that domination? Oh, <laughs> Dalmatians. That was a meme. Cause although I still have not seen one. Okay, I still have not seen one in real life. So I'm just gonna say that I'm skeptical. <laughs> but overall, my cats are dingleberries. Oh, that's cute though. I would love like a black cat, like Salem from Sabrina the Teenage Witch. Cause I just like feeling like a witch. You know what I mean? So, if I ever got a cat, it'd probably be like an old black cat. Or I'll just put ears on Winslow and settle for that, because Winslow is, I mean, he has cat energy. My dogs act, my cat acts more like a dog than a cat. It's okay, my lizard acts just like a cat. Come here. Oh, 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 what are you doing? Oh God, oh God, oh. Sorry, I didn't quite see that. Oh. <laughs> he had my necklace. Ugh. I try to do I try to do things nice with Winslow and he's just like, hell no. Um yes, black cats are the best. I love mine. I love black cats. I had white coat ones and I loved him. Like like little like fluffy Persian cats or just like white cats. Is, is that what those are? I don't know anything about cats. I don't know anything. <laughs> 
but I don't know. I like cats are okay. They're okay in my book. I I do prefer a dog though, but. I have goldfish crackers just in case I got hungry. Let's see. I've had Persian. Oh, Persians. Okay. Past tense of ye is yoted. <laughs> yes, I've successfully yoted myself from pet tube. And I feel great. Even though I'm really congested all of a sudden. Anyone else get this way? Because this has been happening. Oh my god. my dogs these days nothing like a bulldog bulldogs are really cute i want to wear a werewolf cat okay i, I really do have to eat. i i have to google this now <laughs> extra cheese goldfish are better pizza goldfish I, i'm not a huge fan of the pizza goldfish i don't know it's been a while since i've had the extra cheese too i don't know i'm an original girl you know what i mean one second let me fire up the burner Look up mountain chicken. <laughs> I love how this is just turned into um, me googling random stuff. Let's see, did I miss anything? Oh, nope. Okay. So, where wolf cat? I'm expecting a full on werewolf. Like, I want this thing to be the size of my dog. Or a small child. Oh. Oh. It kind of looks like a rat. <laughs> what? I have a transponder. I don't know what that is. It's so you can take the phone. Okay. Sorry, that was my mom. Yeah, they're weird. Um, mountain chicken. Now I gotta look up mountain chicken. This is very riveting stuff. Me talking to my mom and me looking up weird cat breeds. All right. Oh, they're not even chickens, they're frogs. I love it. F in the chat for my wolf cat. They are kind of ugly. I'm not gonna lie, they kind of, I was expecting like, well, what, look at, have you ever heard of a Norwegian forest cat or something like, let me look up the real name of it. Cause it's like this just gigantic burly cat. Oh, Norwegian mountain cat, I think it is. Yeah, they're just like these big burly cats with like so much fur. They actually do kind of look like werewolves. I like the hairless cats. I like hairless cats too. That's why I have Winslow. <laughs> Like, you know, like, why get a super expensive hairless cat when you could just get a lizard and they're basically the same? Well, if they have Winslow's personality, because Winslow just wants to fight. But that's just kind of how cats are, too. Um, yeah. True, yeah. So, yeah. So what's everybody doing tonight? Mm -hmm. Any, any plans? Any hookups? What's the tea? Hi, Megan's mom. <laughs> My parents don't know I'm live streaming right now, so they probably just think I'm recording a video and they're probably like, oh my god. So weird. What is our child? Homework, homework, sleeping. It sounds like me in high school. Math homework? Ugh. No oh, ma'am. No oh, ma'am. You know what's so weird? I am someone who hates math and I took all the way up to pre-calculus in, in college. And yeah, that's it. <laughs> Waiting for dinner, then packing, going to bed early, garage sale in the morning. Oh, that sounds fun! I have to... I just have to do the tags on my video, and then it'll be out for tomorrow, so. New video tomorrow, and I never mentioned that at all. New video tomorrow. Morning, Pacific Standard Time, 10 a.m. It'll be a party. I give some real Aunt Zelda vibes. It's really cute. Let's see. Um, I feel like I'm going to sleep on time and actually sleep. Armored wings. I love that for you. I would also like that myself. <laughs> I 
not my sleep cycle is so trash so here's the thing it's literally 1 a.m here but i'm an insomniac boba tea same queen my sleep cycle is so trash because i'm very um addicted to caffeine very heavily and because i've been hitting the pumpkin spice latte so heavy lately i have um sort of really messed up my sleep cycle so i get a caffeine headache around like 3 p.m so that's why i'm trying to push it back like further and further hello strong empowered dragon mama oh thank you queen um yeah it's like last night i got a caffeine headache at like 11 p.m and i'm like i am not not drinking a coca-cola at 11 o'clock at night i'm gonna go to sleep at three how much longer are you going? I have no idea. <laughs> I don't know. It's been an hour and a half. Because I've never done a live stream, so I don't know how to end a live stream. I also don't know when is like a good time to stop. I also started really early for me. So who knows? Okay, let's go back up. Let's go back up. Let's go back up. Okay. Math is easy. I'm in calculus. Oh, honey. Oof. Can't relate. I have 110 in English and 76 in math. Kelly, don't worry, that was me all throughout high school. Um, I should be doing laundry, my mom is visiting tomorrow, but here I am. Amelia, we love procrastination. Uh, mine too, I didn't fall asleep until 8 a.m. today, but not for like of trying last night. Wait, you fell asleep? Oh, you fell asleep at 8 a.m. Okay, ooh, sis, damn. English is hard, English can be hard. Chilling, dying forever alone with my animals, relatable. Probably staying up until a stupid time, like 2 or 3 a.m. Same. Oh, and it's feeding nights for my snakes. Cute. I can't drink caffeine anymore because anxiety. Okay, bye, Dylan. Have fun. Because anxiety. Girl, I get you. I should probably start drinking it myself, but here we are. I had a coffee today. I was very good, though, and did not have a coffee in the middle of my day so laying down until early morning because of insomnia i love being your guys is like insomnia soother you know what i mean because i remember being like a little kid before like i had netflix or hulu or something like that and you'd turn on a show and it was like or you turn on the tv to like try to lull yourself back to sleep and it would just be like the worst <laughs> it'd be like some terrible infomercial and you're just like ugh. Now I can just, you know, rewatch Archer, but it's cute. It's cute. I took my, I took my anxiety pills with my, but it's probably not the best idea. Oh, you take it with your coffee. Maybe. Um, it took a long time, but it helped a lot. Or I heard, I don't know what that is. I'm very bad with medication names because I can't pronounce them. So, yeah, I'm... Yeah, I'm gonna do the tag of my video. Thumbnail is done. I just have to do tags. I hate tags. Can't sleep because my brain starts dragging me up. Bad memories. Armored, same. Every day. So, that's why I have to fall asleep with the TV on. Which, I know everybody's like, oh my god, that's awful. How could you do that to yourself? Anxiety. <laughs> yeah. So, and then I'll probably, I don't know. Make some food, cuddle with my dragon, watch Disenchantment. That's probably what I'm going to do later tonight, so. So I don't know how much longer to do this. I'll probably do it, probably get off soon, but I don't know. I'll get off. Are my eyelashes starting to come off? I like how I've ab abandoned all mirrors and just decided to use my camera. No, my eyelashes are still on. This is a record. I put these on first try, they're not coming up. Thank you, Jesus. I mean, thank you, Trixie and Katya. Thank you. It's like a lot of people take, oh, it takes the jitters from caffeine. It's natural in a lot of teas. That's cute. I don't really get jitters from caffeine though. You hate when you let your dragon sleep on noon and then you have to get up. Yes. Me and Winslow were snuggling like so good last night. It was so cute. And then I had to like get up and shower and stuff like that. You know, be a, be a person. Gotta take care of myself. Oh, 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 oh
May the last gods be with you. Thank you, Amelia. Even when I'm trying to sleep, I somehow seem to come up with the best ideas when I'm trying to sleep. That happens to me sometimes too. Or I'll like come up with a good video idea, idea like right as I'm going to sleep and then I wake up and then I write down my phone. Which does, does honestly help me. Oh, me too. I get a tablet and fall asleep listening to relaxing YouTube bins like the ASMR rain ones. Oh, that sounds cute. My mom always saying I can't sleep because of an electric magnetic field in my room. Your mom has been going down the YouTube uh, rabbit holes for far too long. <laughs> sorry to say, but I'm mean, probably not sorry, but electromagnetic fields. Wait, what? I, I don't know. That's weird. Oh, it flashes happens. Hang on. Smog finds a way to poop on my bed or me. Yeah, I think you you may have missed the part in the live stream where Winslow actively tried to poop on me and then pooped on my chair. It was a fun time. <laughs> I remember I think I made a promise to always show as much dragon poop as I could because owning bearded dragons, not exactly the easiest thing. You know what I mean? But oh, I look really pretty today though. How are you all? Oh, thanks. Oh my God, a bunch of people. Okay. Hi, how are you all? Oh, thank you. I'm good, thank you. She's one of the Facebook moms. Oh, does she have the haircut? You know, the cut, you know what I mean? Just got home from tutoring, what's been happening? Nothing. My mom says my devices emit waves that keep your brains awake. Okay. According to him, giving, giving your phone and your bra gives you breast cancer too. I remember that one. I remember people saying that because I used to be like that girl because I didn't have a because because I didn't have a purse for a really long time I didn't carry one I was like no I'm gonna be a rebel and I would stick it in there because I mean it's always on me so oh, and I remember something if I have to do or forget something I can't sleep till I deal with it I think I showed up right as you were cleaning up the dragon boob yep so much attitude via dragons sis that's my whole channel the I want to speak with the manager cut? Yes. She really believes it. Dr. Oz can huff paint for all I care. I don't know. Some people believe some really weird things. Actually, my mom used to always tell me that you can't put new shoes on a table because it means bad luck. And now I've adopted the same way of things. So now whenever I have new shoes, I always, I never put him on a table. Put him on the chair. I don't know, it's some Irish nonsense. He's quite the man. Yeah, you know, the only doctor I stand is Dr. Phil. Ranch. You're still live? Bravo. Thank you, Dusty. I'm not a quitter. <laughs> oh my god, I just have to tell you guys. Let, let me make an apology real quick, because I might need to. Um... I apologize to everybody that I roast in tomorrow's video. Yeah. Sorry. I always put my new shoes on the table. That explains my bad luck. Winslow. I let you into my room, but I don't trust you, uh, Shade. Wait until I see you tomorrow. The apology video's in the works. Shoes on the table invites a fight, according to my German grandmother. Really? I've never heard that. So when do new things stop being new? Um, probably like after the like once there's like I don't know. Like I wouldn't consider this coat new. I got it like three years ago. Um, I don't even know if I could, I got this like four weeks ago. Are you filming in your bathroom? Yes, my beautifully painted bathroom. My beautifully aesthetically pleasing bathroom? Of course I am. How are your plants doing? My plants are doing really well. Thank you. Miss um, Cracker has actually started to um, get some new, new, new growth. Uh, good thing I got rid of my table. I always thought it was a weird German thing. I always thought it was a weird Irish thing. See, I watch videos sometimes. Well, apparently you don't, because I've been filming in my bathroom for like two weeks. So. I'm kidding. I just love being spicy. 
I lost my life thanks to Jetta. You have 38? Oh my god, I still only have Tammy, Cracker, uh, Linda Evangelista, my Aloe Plant, Destiny's Child, and my two cactuses. I only have seven, which isn't, isn't too many. Did I miss? Oh, the Pet Rocks are doing great. And somebody else asked earlier, they're doing fantastic. I got four, they're all dead. Sorry, I'm congested. I'm gonna have to like, I'm gonna have to go to, well, I'll try to make it to two hours because my nose is starting to get congested for some weird, weird reason. I should take an allergy pill. Pet, la Pet rock lives do matter, guys. Spread the hashtag, spread the word. Pet rock lives matter. Ugh. Destiny's Child. Yes, so I have a plant that's like three plants together that I have not been able to separate yet. Um, I'm gonna do it soon, I promise. Um, and, and somebody was like, oh, there's three of them. Name them Destiny's Child and whoever does the best can be Beyonce. I was like, wow, that's brilliant. I have some seashells. They are good companions for pet rocks or are they too aggressive? Yes, they are too aggressive. Pet rocks are very too, are very aggressive. I don't know how mine are alive. I just forget to water them until I see them melting. I mean, that's fine. Oh, that makes sense. Yeah, you know, it's actually, I always have to like be careful with these vanities sometimes here. It just cause like if it, cause it's usually super hot. So you can usually get away with watering my plants every day. Cause it's just, it's just so dry here. But lately the humidity has been kind of weird. So I had like, a, I had a week where I didn't even water Miss Cracker and she's perfectly fine. How's Queen Bean? Queen Bean is doing great. Um, I'd get her out, but she doesn't like the ring light just cause I don't know. She just, she doesn't like, she doesn't like light. She, she's, she's an albino. So who's going to Akushela? Not me. <laughs> I'll be here in my pink bathroom while everyone else is doing pet tuber stuff. Me and Dolly Parton over here. My brother has a pet rock that lives in her car named Norbert. Cute. Stunning. No, we are rock destroyers. I'll come up with some sort of intro for that. Oh, whoops, 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 whoops. Were you ever gonna change the channel name? I have, com I've contemplated it. Um, it's just, I don't know. I, I like put a poll up, but it was so close. Like, if it was, like, 80-20, I probably would change it. But because it was, like, like, 54% to, like, 40-something. I can't do math. I was, like, maybe I shouldn't. This is Winslow. He is a dragon. I am a woman. I am Megan, a woman. Um, I have new aquarium plants. I have no idea if they're going to do okay. But at least I'm not dead. You know, that's, that's a good thing. Oh, there's, like, a bunch of people left. No commitment until you know what you want. Yep, queen. Bean is our queen. Long live the queen. Yep. Um, I'm peach impeaching the Wizard of the Dragon moniker. <laughs> Requires a two thirds. Derek with the political commentary. We stand. I left because it froze. Oh, yeah, sorry. Oh, hi, Anna. You're back. Yeah, it disconnected me for some weird reason. I think that's why a bunch of people left. I don't blame them. Whatever. I'm probably going to get off and like 15 minutes or something like that because my nose is weird right now. But... <coughs> Whatever. I'm getting a baby hog nose. Conda. Oh, cute. I love condas. They're cute. Lose Lewis King, he is. Yes. Yeah, it disconnected me. Like, it didn't even freeze. It just disconnected me. I was like, we can't connect you. I'm like, you were doing it. I thought they were kicking me off for some reason. Like, I thought I'd reached a time limit or something like that. Hello, thank you for coming back to my live stream, everybody. Welcome back. I'm sorry YouTube disconnected me. Um, I don't know why it did. Yeah. So, yes. Winslow, please do not poop on me twice in one live stream. If you just joined us, you missed about an hour ago, or Winslow... Pooped on me. I'm watching without volume because I have to be quiet for the moment. Okay, guys, everybody whisper in the chat so that Anna can still watch us. Winslow, remember to whisper. We gotta whisper. Hi, guys. It's ASMR Megan. Today we're gonna be doing some fine dragon ASMR. Thank you. 
what? He looks like Pancake. He is a Pancake. Damn, why won't you let me give you money? Wait, you want to give me money, Dusty? For what? <laughs> I love money. No worries, girl. YouTube does its own thing. YouTube does so much things. Yeah, he does that when he's, like, warm. Um, he gets, like, really flat. Because the ring light's kind of warm, so it's... He's also, like, laying in my lap, so... He's a weird little guy. What do you think about all the cute furniture they have for beardies they can poop on? Oh, just, you know, I love it. There's no donation button. Yeah, I don't, this is my first live stream, so I don't even know how to do a donation button. I don't know. But, oh my god. Blizzards flatten when warm. Uh, bearded dragons do sometimes. Not all the time, but sometimes they'll, like, flatten themselves out. It's really cute. Like, when he, like, he has a, he has, like, a dark hide. It's, like, dark gray. It's a castle hide. I paid for him for, like, like forever ago. And he likes to, like, flatten himself out first thing in the morning when it gets nice and warm. It's very cute. He also loves to beard stretch. Yeah. Yeah, where the button at? I don't know how to enable the button. You guys are vastly overestimating how technically advanced I am at, um, at live streaming. This is my first live stream. Hello backwards. Hello? 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 But, you know. Oh, yeah, whatever goes in. Oh, 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 you have to enable in settings. Okay, I'll do that later. Winslow needs a diaper. He does. Can you do this again tomorrow night or Saturday? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if I'll have makeup on Saturday or Sunday. Although I do have it off. I don't know. Pancakes and sexy leg infiltrate all the beauty groups. Yep. That's where my dog put my head up on her keyboard. So when are you getting a cat? I can't have a cat, Dusty. If you're talking to me, I don't know if you're talking to me. I can't get a cat. But I do have a hairless cat already. Lindsay, give him a good glare. Give him a good glare for well it's boring but also my dog would kill it so it's fine give him a good glare Winslow not as cute as my frog Dusty I will fight you I will pull up to Aquashella and fight you also Winslow will Winslow would Win y'all don't want this smoke okay y'all don't want this smoke especially a frog doesn't want this smoke okay I'm like trying to burp. Winslow is so much cuter. Yeah. Cuter than me, cuter than everything. Especially because he's so yellow right now. Because he, 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 he's so cute when he does that. My beard, he has a stub tail. I'm kind of jealous now. My beta cobra commander will rule over your frog and dragon. Bring it. Winslow is, listen, Winslow, Coke, Coke, what? Oh, yeah, you missed my whole tangent and the whole chat supporting my Coca-Cola, Dusty. Scroll up. But, you know, Coke for the win. Look at the chat. Thank you, chat, for supporting me. And my Coca-Cola regime, Coca-Cola only. I even matched my lips to it. But, yeah. Ugh. No, I'm good, I'm good. My makeup looks so pretty today. So yeah, I'll probably get off in like 10 minutes um, if y'all are, I don't know, actually doing something. Uh, I gotta give some of that Coke to Winslow, <laughs> says Cher. Or with a legend. Water's better. Water doesn't have caffeine in it though, Isaiah. And I am horribly addicted. That's what's wrong with them. I was trying to figure it out. Hashtag shade. 
Coke is the best in root beer. I, I'm okay with root beer. There's a place. I think it was Jersey Mike Sub. They don't have Coke or Pepsi. Like, they don't have number one or number two. They literally just have, like, Sierra Mist and root beer and a bunch of other weird stuff. And I'm just like, Ugh. Or root beer is caffeine. Yeah, I need, I need caffeine at all, at all times. I'm heavily addicted. Root beer is okay. Root beer floats are bomb, though. Not gonna lie. I, I, I really, root beer floats are legit. I like how we're just talking about soda. What, let's see, what other sodas are there? <laughs> Can we talk about the McDonald's Sprite for a second? If I wanted to drink something bad, I'd have a Coke. If I wanted to drink garbage, I would drink uh, Pepsi. Worst soda ever is Moxie. I've never had that. Root beer, Dr. Pepper, tastes like medicine to me. Ooh. <laughs> Dr. Pepper's better bite me. I'm the antagonist now. I love a Dr. Pepper. I do. But listen, listen. That McDonald's Coca Cola. <laughs> so good. Also, the McDonald's Sprite really just hits different. Like, mm. the same with um, Jack in the Box. Jack in the Box sodas. Also, ginger ale is good. I know I'm an old person. Ginger ale reminds Why can't I chat back? <gasps> I'm back. Hello? Hello? Oh wow, there's one person watching. Cute. Love it. Oh no, there are people back. Okay. I'm gonna get off in five minutes. It's fine. Um, I'm sorry YouTube keeps disconnecting me. I was trying to, like, type to you guys, but I didn't want to expose my, my private account. I wonder what it tastes like to mix Coke and Pepsi. I don't know. I've never drank, um, garbage. Um, because of Pepsi, we're not having this problem earlier when we were talking about <laughs> Hello? Nice close-up. Thank you. Oh, you can really see the stain. Thank you for everyone who um, came back. Not your fault. You back. I am. Bubbles, love your content. You remind me of my best friend. Oh, thank you. Oh, God. You can really see how yellow my teeth is. Sorry. Howdy. Oh, sorry. Give it a minute. Like, it's just... I don't know. I don't know what... Here's her line for when you leave. What was Elton John's sexual orientation in the in the 80s? Bisexual. What? Dusty, explain. When we were talking about Elton John, I could die happy now. Oh, I'm happy for that, Bubbles. I'm happy for you. <laughs> okay. Back to looking cute. Ooh, that was good. Oh, bisexual. I mean, that's cute. Okay, I get it now. You should have spelt it like B-Y-E though. Never mind. Oh my God, that was good. Ugh, I know, I'm gross. Um, Yeah, guys, thank you for coming to my live stream. I'm gonna hop off here in a hot minute. Also, I love Miss Bean. Beaumont and Eleanor. That's so dignified. I just named my leopard gecko after a rapper and a TV character. Wow, what, Dusty, what? We can fight about it. Um, oh, thank you for coming back, Connor. I am just kind of wrapping this up, but you can enjoy the, the rest of it. It'll be, it'll be a party. Um, yeah, thank you all for joining me today. Um, I think two hours is like a good, good amount of time for live streaming, you know. Um, yeah. We'll go for three more minutes. What, what are y'all's questions for me? Lay them on me. 
Get all up in my business. Everyone is a meme today. Love memes. Named by Crested Gecko after a Pokemon. Love it. It was fun. Thanks for the stream. You're welcome. I want to do more. Let me know if I should do more. Um, it, I named my Gargoyle Gecko after a Spice Girl, so. Dusty is my best friend and I'm thankful for his friendship. How, that closer? There we go. Why'd you start YouTube? I have always wanted to be a YouTuber since I was 14 and now that I am 22, um, just, well I started when I was 21. Um, I don't know. It's always been an escape for me. So I like providing that escape that other people provided me for other people too. And I missed a couple questions. Oh, if you were to get another snake, what breed would you get and what would you name it? I would get another hognose and I would name it Lana. So I could have Sterling Mallory Archer and Lana Kane. Do more. Okay. Thank you for making my closing shift interesting. You're welcome because I close literally all the time and I would love for someone to make them um, very good. Thank you for the stream. It was fun. You should do it again. I met, I, I probably will. I made so many friends on YouTube. Me too. If you're ending this, I have no excuses to go to the gym. Go to the gym, Amelia. It's good for your health. How's Tinder? Terrible. <laughs> it's, um, I believe in my last video, I said that Shakespeare could not have written a more he heartfelt tragedy than my love life. So, you know, that's cute. Oh, I almost named my dog Sterling after Archer. I love the name Sterling. I might name my kid Sterling. I just love that name. And it's like unisex too, so it's like my firstborn child might be named Sterling. There we go. Oh, mostly animal people. Yeah, you should do live streams. You should do a bunch of random live streams. No, I'll probably schedule them because I, I want people to be able to like participate and like hang out. Arts, hog knows is poisonous. They are venomous. Um, oh, I gotta wrap this up. So they are rearfing venomous. Well, that's a tad depressing. Welcome to my life, Dusty. Welcome to my life. Um, hog noses are rearfing venomous. So like it, they really need to get a good grip on you to really um, actually like like bite you and I don't know, inseminate. Is that no? That's not a good word. To get the poison, I mean, the venom into your body. But even then, it's really not a very potent toxin. So it'll probably, it's probably like a bee sting. That's what most people kind of compare it to. And I miss a lot of chat. Um, they are illegal in some places though. My gym, the gym near me serves pizza. They're trying for repeat business, okay? They're like, okay, let's get them in. Let's feed them pizza afterward. There's a kid named Sterling in my class. I don't like him, yeah. I miss your two videos. Will they make a comeback? I don't know, Bubbles. I'm not gonna lie. Um, maybe, maybe not. I don't know. I'm a Gemini. I could change my mind. Um, I'm ready for meme review. It's coming. Um, can't kill you then. Okay. I'm very confused by that last one, Madison. Are you trying to kill me? Should I be worried? Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and end it here because my nose is like super congested. <laughs> also, I'm hungry. So thank you for joining me today, guys. I will probably do, oh God, there's a bunch of them. Um, oh, the hog nose. Oh no, hog noses can't kill you. The dog of the salon I go to is named Sterling. 10 out of 10 would get their hair done for the dog company. Oh, cute. Yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead. Oh my God. Good night, Miss Dragon. Oh, thank you. I rewatch this, listen to your tea videos about pet pests all the time. Oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you for loving the videos, Bubbles. I love it. The return of cheap champagne. I have, however, moved up to cheap tequila. Bye, Centurion. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna go. Have a good day, guys. Um, I don't know when the next live stream will be. I will announce it on my community page. Or my social medias, you can follow me there. Okay, bye girl. Bye. Hug Winslow for me. I will try. You will probably try to scratch my face out. But that's okay. So yeah, I'm gonna go eat some dinner.
Okay, at this point, the chat's just Dusty making bye jokes. Okay, how do I end this?